Do you struggle with hip pain that keeps you up at night? Don't worry. We've got you covered. We're going to show you some sleep positions that are going to help eliminate this problem so you can sleep all night long comfortably like me. And me. <laughs> all right. The first thumbs down is stay away from sleeping on the point of your hip. Show them, Mike. So right now we're talking about my left hip here. So if I'm laying laterally right on it, it's going to put a lot of pressure on it, and it's not going to feel good. I personally had this issue before, and this was not an option for me to lay like this. That's, and my wife just had this issue about three weeks ago. Oh. She asked me for help, and naturally I concurred, and she's fine now. Oh, well, that's good. It's true. And number two thumbs down is stretching out those hip tissues on the hip on top. So we're talking about my right hip right now. Again, it's more lateral pain. Right now, my hip is adducting and stretching, and it's going to put a lot of pressure on that lateral hip, and it's not going to feel good if you're having pain. And the third and final thumbs down is lying prone or on your stomach. Go ahead, Mike. So if you have tight hip flexors, you might actually be pulling your pelvis into a tilt and you actually might be kind of having your butt up in the air like this and it's not going to be very comfortable. All right, for the first thumbs up to correct taking pressure off the point of the hip, as we mentioned, we're going to need some pillows. Go ahead. Yeah, so this will be if you're going to lay on the side that is painful, you want to put a pillow underneath by your rib cage, kind of above your pelvis like this, and it's going to take some pressure off of the lateral hip because it's going to be going through the pillow. Okay, the next thumb up, we want to uh, address that painful stretched out hip on top. How do we use pillows for this, Mike? So this is like Brad was just talking about, sleeping on the good side, painful side on top. But you're still going to stretch it if you're keeping your knees together, touching like this. So, especially, especially if you go like this. Yes, you're really stretching yeah. it out. So Sorry to interrupt. You can grab a pillow and simply put it between your knees. You can try different positions. You can go like this. Or if you want to get the whole leg, you mm. can go the long way like this. And lastly, let's address prone or lying on your stomach. Let's go to it, Mike. So stomach sleepers, if you do have tight hips, what you can do is just place a pillow down on your stomach region right here and just lay like this, and this should take the pressure off of those tight hip flexors. You can mess with the amount of pillows you are using here as well, and that will take even more pressure off. Over time, if you can, try to eliminate the pillow, and that'll actually give you some passive hip flexor stretching.